Hello Interwebs, welcome to Let's Fix Computers. We've got a Lenovo Z50 here, which has no power and no charge. So when I plug in the charger, we get no light at the front, no lights, um, and the computer doesn't turn on. Which I'm just gonna test now. Nope, it does not turn on. And the charger jack is really, really loose. Like, like yeah, there's a lot of movement. PC World have taken a look at this one, so I'm expecting to find signs that it's been disassembled before. However, they say they couldn't get the parts. Not quite sure what that means, because uh, replacement power jacks are readily available for this laptop. So I don't know if that means it's not the power jack or what. So let's strip this thing down and let's find out if PC World are morons or whether there is something more to this than it seems. All right, we have a loose screw and a sealed warranty sticker, which means this laptop has never been disassembled because I somehow doubt that uh, PC World would have put new Lenovo warranty stickers on it. So PC World didn't take it apart. So that means this probably is as easy as it looks. Good job. Good job. Okay, now, is the top coming off or is the bottom coming off? I think the bottom is coming off. These are some fairly vicious clips. Oh, there it goes. It's all about finding the right angle. Okay, no, it looks like the top wants to come off. So we're gonna go upright again. Okay, it looks like the cooler is attached to the back of this, so we need to check that. I think that fan needs to come out. God, this one's a pain in the backside to get into. Oh yeah, idiot. There we go. Right, anything hanging on? Nope, we okay. So, what happened here? So there's no visible damage. We've got, oh no, yeah, we've got a missing clip here on the inside where the power jack sits. Um, the power jack is on a fly lead, it's not soldered onto a board. This button here is on the power button board, so there's no cause for concern about it being a soldered jack. It's a very lightweight laptop this, so it's actually quite difficult to balance it. Go put my uh, tester to use. Right, let's have a look at this fella. What's your story? There we go. That fella's just fallen straight out, so. Okay, let's take this out and see if it can be mended. Okay, so we can clearly see <clears throat> We can clearly see where that little fella was sold onto there and that's just come off. So all we're gonna do, we're just going to strip that back a little bit, re-solder that, and we'll put some hot glue along there to strengthen that connection. And that should protect it from coming adrift in the future. 
Eesh, we've just lost that one as well. You know what? I'm going to pull this whole thing back and redo the whole lot, I think. Anyone else coming off? Anyone? Okay, there's our cleaned up connector. Let's strip this little back a little bit and get some fresh wire. Alright, there we go. There's our resoldered and strengthened connector. Alright, so we've got our DC jack put back in and that's all wired in nicely. Uh, I didn't show you the cable tied in because it was a really fiddly job. Uh, we need to put a battery in this to check if it's going to work because there's no AC light on this laptop. There's only a charge light, so battery plugged in. Well, can we get that to fit better? There we go. And powering. And we have a light. I assume flashing means charging. So let's get the rest of this reassembled and just double check that that looks all right once we're into Windows. Now I'm just going to clear out that dusty vent. Looks better. And the fan, I'll give that a quick hit with the air compressor.
God, this battery is a pain in the backside. There we go. Right, before I put all the rest of the screws in, I'm gonna start it up and make sure it works, just in case I have to take it all apart again. All right, on we go. And we have power. And we have boot. We'll just get that into Windows and we'll just see if that battery is charging properly. It's entirely possible that this just has a knackered battery, which is why the light is flashing instead of staying on steady. Either that or that's just the behavior of this laptop. Okay, right, the lag was real, but we got there in the end. We are plugged in, powered on, logged in, and charging. This is all fixed, so we'll put the rest of the screws back in the bottom of this, give it a service, and it'll be absolutely fine. Right, we'll just remove this junk without showing off all the customer's details. There we go. And let's make this laptop clean again. There we go. Beautiful. Thank you very much for watching everyone. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye for now.